Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this is Dead Carpet Energy Drink Reviews, and it's 4.39 p.m. And it's Tuesday, January 17th, 2023. I just shaved. I didn't get all of it, but I got most of it, so that's good. I'll just get the rest of it later. But um, I didn't take a shower, so um, I put on my shirt again. There were, like, hairs, like, sticking through the shirt. I tried getting a lot of them off of it, but, um, oh well. But, um, anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing the last drink that I got at the Nam High Grocery Store in Tulsa. It's like an Asian grocery store, and it's like a big place, you know? Um, I also forgot to mention I had like a weird deja vu feeling when I went in there. I felt like I'd already been in there before. Because um, there was like a, looked like a liquor store right across from like a place where like um, people were like eating. And it was like one straight hallway in the middle, and then that middle part led to the grocery store. So you know what I mean? But um, anyway, so I thought it looked cool, you know? And it was weird though, but you know what I mean? But um, anyway... Um, yeah, today I'm going to be reviewing the last one of the drinks that I got there. It's another one of these Caribou energy drinks. This one sounds like it might be pretty good. We shall see. Anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing the Mandarin Orange Caribou energy drink. So, oh yeah, boys, look at that can. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah. It has a silver top, the silver tab. The bomb's the Best Buy Dayton production code. Best Buy... Looks like December 16th, 2022, so just a little bit past the Best Buy date, so it still should be good. This one doesn't have, like, the Caribou logos at the top like the last one I reviewed did. It's just, like, a plain top. But around the top it says, still, says, when football tickets at CariboEnergy.co.uk, and it says the same thing again. But in the UK, football's in, like, not American football, you know? It's, like, um, sort of like soccer, you know? Um, but yeah, that has a Caribou logo, energy drink, Mandarin Orange, only 63 calories per can. Caribou Cup has a Caribou logo again, and EA, I mean EFL. And then has the same thing on this side. It has like a nutrition fact sticker, it's in English, but um, I could already read off the can, you know, because it's already in English. Um, because it's from the UK, but um, anyway. Um, and this side has SKU and like the description and the nutrition facts and stuff and other ingredients. I'll just read off the nutrition facts and stuff off the sticker, you know, just saying. But um, anyway, Caribou is a great tasting sparkling mandarin orange flavored energy drink with taurine, caffeine, B vitamins with sugar and sweeteners. Only 63 calories per can, high caffeine content, not recommended for children. Sorry, I messed up. For children, pregnant, or breastfeeding women, 32 milligrams slash 100 milligrams caffeine per can. So it has 330 milliliters, so that's like 32 times 3 is like um, 96, and then plus 30 milliliters. So I'm guessing it has like around 100 milligrams caffeine in the entire can, so you know what I mean? Um, but yeah, consume in moderation as part of a varied and balanced diet and healthy lifestyle. Imported by Inter Caribou Limited, Aquis House 49-51, Blog Revest Reading RG1 1PL, manufactured by Caribou. To Wandang Company Limited, Chacho Engsau Province, Thailand, 24130 www.caraboenergy.co.uk. Once open, keep refrigerated and consume within three days. Best served shield, store in a cool, dry place out of direct sunlight. Product of Thailand, aluminum can, widely recycled. Has like their recycling logo. Best with 4C basic can, 330 milliliters. Um, so, yeah, there's actually not a lot of stuff on the can. Um, but I'll probably take off this sticker when I do my Instagram photo. Um, but yeah. Mandarin Orange Nutrition Facts. Serving as one. Serving size one can, 330 milliliters. Number of serving calories, 60. Total fat, 0 grams, 0 percent. Saturated fat, 0 grams, 0 percent. Trans fat, 0 grams. Cholesterol, 0 milligrams, 0 percent. Sodium, 260 milligrams, 10 percent. Total carbohydrates, 15 grams, 5 percent. Fiber, 0 grams, 0 percent. Total sugars, 15 grams. Clues, 15 grams. Added sugars, 30 percent. So yeah, it's actually low in sugar. Um, especially compared to, like, those Sting energy drinks that I reviewed, like, yesterday. And, um, yeah. Protein less than 1 gram, vitamin D 0%, calcium 0%, iron 0%, potassium 0%, niacin 210%, vitamin B6 470%, vitamin B12 330%, panathenic acid 160%, so yeah, it's high in the B vitamins and stuff. Other ingredients, water, sucrose, citric acid, taurine, artificial flavor, caffeine, aspartame, and nostal, sodium benzoate as a preservative, black carrot, beta carotene, niacinamide, xanthan gum, stevia glycoside, dexpanthenol, vitamin B6 and vitamin B12, phenolate contains phenylalanine, has some more recycling stuff, 
imported by HC Foods Company Limited, Commerce, California, 90040. That weighed 11.15 foot ounces, 330 milliliters. So yeah, that's pretty much the entire can. So I'll let you see it right quick. I'll show it off up close too though in a minute. I like the design of the can. It has like these arrows at the bottom. It looks like pyramids or something. At the top of the can too. I like the logo. It's like a bull head or a caribou head. A while ago, there was like a um, a lot of police cars and an ambulance, cause um, I guess like I don't know, someone may have died like near me. But luckily, I think the cops all left a while ago. But I still see an ambulance like drive over there a while ago. So I don't know if like um, someone was like choking or something or what happened. I'm not really for sure. But um. Hopefully they're okay, you know. But it might not be of cops and an ambulance game. Just saying. Um, but yeah. It's a little bit reflective, so I'm sorry about that. Just pause it where you can see it best. Okay, now for the nutrition fact sticker. Yeah, I had to shave today because tomorrow we have like an inspection at work. And um, it's a lot of the main company, like big people, you know, are going to be coming by. And we're actually supposed to be wearing hair nets and like beard nets, but um, we like never do, you know, just saying. Um, but only when like the company shows up, then we wear like our hair nets and we're supposed to wear the beard nets if we have a beard. But um, normally if you shave though, you don't have to wear the, you know, beard net. So I shaved tonight, you know. Because tomorrow's that big inspection, but um, anyway, yeah, that's pretty much the entire can. Now I'm going to show it off up close right quick, so hold on a minute. The Mandarin Orange Caribou Energy Drink. This one has a sticker on it. The last few Sting Energy Drinks I did didn't have, like, the sticker, but I didn't actually need the sticker on this one because I can read most of this one. Because even though it's a made in Thailand, this is a UK-produced can for, like, selling the UK, you know? Or like, um, yeah, silver top, silver top, this one doesn't have the writing on it like the green apple one did. Best before December 16th, 2022, so this one's a little bit fresher than the green apple one, but um, it's still a little bit past the best by date. Um, see what I mean? One football tickets, but it's not like American football, it's like soccer though. Like the design has like an arrow in there or something at the bottom. Looks pretty cool. Okay, there's the sticker with the nutrition facts and stuff. Other ingredients: 11.15 foot ounces, 330 milliliters, 63 calories per can, Caribou cup, SKU. Now for the nutrition facts side and the description and other ingredients and stuff. Yeah, it has um, 32 milligrams caffeine per 100 milliliters, but it has like 330 milliliters. So it has basically uh, about 100 milligrams caffeine in the entire can. So yeah, it has pretty much the entire can, so now I'm going to finish my review for it, so hold on a minute. Okay, I shut off the can up close, and I'm going to shake it up a little bit, open it, taste it, and give my review for it, so hold on a minute. Yeah, it was actually um, pretty cheap. It was like $1.49 before tax. So I didn't have to pay like, you know, expensive shipping to get it. Um, because it's already, you know, shipped here at that Asian grocery store. I don't know why they have the UK can at the Asian grocery store instead of, like, the, you know, the Asian can, but oh well. But yeah, the color, it looks pretty much the same as the green apple one. Like a light, clear color, but a little bit like a gold tint. Um, I don't know if you can see it too well, though, because of the lighting. But yeah, it does have, like, a tint of gold. Mostly clear, though. It's definitely carbonated. Definitely has bubbles. But, um, anyway, the scent... Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. 
Well, 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 well. <sighs> Definitely like a sweet candy mango. Not like that, you know, strong, like, natural mango, which I don't really like. This, this is definitely more like a candy sort of sweet mango. Sort of similar to, like, the Venom Energy Drink, but, um... I don't know, this one has more of, like, a floral type of scent, though. It might have a little bit of an earthy scent, but, um... Yeah, it's definitely... I don't know, definitely more of, a, like, a citrusy or stronger citrus sort of smell. I don't know how to describe it, but, um, yeah, because it's, like, Mandarin in orange, or Mandarin orange, you know, this type of orange, but, um, yep. Yeah, I don't know why I said mango, but, um, it does have a little bit of mango scent, though. Um, yeah, but it's supposed to be Mandarin orange, not mango orange. Uh, I don't know, I messed up, thought about that, I don't know. Um, but, yeah, it does have a little bit of a mango scent, but, um, yeah, it's supposed to be just mandarin orange, which, uh, mandarin orange is, like, a different type of orange, but, um, yeah, it's definitely more of, like, a citrusier, like, I don't know, like a tangy citrus sort of smell, but, yeah, it smells pretty good, though, but, I mean, anyway, now I'm gonna try it, so here goes. Oh, yeah, boys. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. And, yep. Even though it's not mango orange, it does have a little bit of a mango taste. But definitely has that mandarin orange flavor too, though. Very strong citrusy flavor. Sweet but tart and tangy at the same time. It's not too carbonating. You can probably check it if you want to, but um. Yep, like a zesty orange, but um. But it has a light mango sort of flavor too, though, so what I mean? That's like what it reminds me of anyway, but, um, so actually really good. I actually like this one better than the green apple one. I thought I would like the green apple one, but, um, it didn't really taste like green apple. It was more just like regular apple, maybe like a hint of green apple, but, um, yeah, this though, this is definitely like mandarin orange, but, um, with a little bit of mango flavor too, though, so what I mean? So yeah, it's actually really good has a cool can design, I like the look of it, because, like, orange is, like, one of my favorite colors, you know? I like the logo and stuff, too. It stands out. has a cool, interesting design. Energy-wise, it'll definitely get you lit. It has around 100 milligrams of caffeine in the entire can, and it's high in the B vitamins and stuff. So I'd say energy-wise, it lasts about two and a half hours, about four hours of energy. So, oh, yeah, boys, it'll definitely get you lit. So, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Definitely try it if you can find it. I got it in an Asian grocery store, but, um... There's another flavor that they didn't have, which I still need to get to review. Um, one of my energy drink friends on Instagram, Tyler, posted a picture of it, but it was like a mixed berry flavor, because he posted that one and this one and the green apple one. Um, so yeah, I'll have to try to get the mixed berry one sometime and review it, but um, yeah, this one's really good. Definitely like it better than the green apple one. It's actually really good. Um, so it might be a little bit too tart, or too tangy um, anyway, but um... Yeah, it might have a little bit of a sour taste too, though, but, um, yeah, it's definitely pretty good, though, even though it's still tart, but you know what I mean? Yeah, I do like it. It has a little bit of a mango taste, but, um, still really good, though. Definitely like a candy citrus flavor, so you know what I mean? But, yeah, I actually definitely highly recommend trying this one. It's really lit. Probably give the Mandarin Orange Caribou Energy Drink a 9 out of 10. So, oh yeah, boys, it's lit. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. Oh yeah, it has a really cool can design. It tastes good. Energy-wise, it works really good. It was cheap as like $1.49 before tax. So, yeah, definitely try it if you can find it. I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. Anyway, my next three reviews are going to be some energy drinks a company sent me to review. Um, I'm not really sure how to pronounce these drinks, though. Um, I don't know if it's pronounced like Joey or Joy E, but... Um, yeah, I'm going to be reviewing three flavors of those drinks that they sent me. Stay tuned for those reviews. Stay tuned for my reviews. Stay tuned for more videos. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace out. And bye.